Hi friends, this is Naresh. Welcome to my channel Technical Talks with Naresh. So today I am going to prepare a video on schedule the BI report job in Oracle Fusion. Okay. So in last videos we had seen that how to prepare the BI report using the wizard method as well as the manual method. But we had run that report using the developer perspective. But today I am going to tell you how to run that report using the schedule jobs. Okay. For that we will go to our oracle fusion instance front end so this is my oracle fusion instance front end if you remember how to go to the catalog window so for that click on the navigator and click on tools then the report and analytics when you click on reports and analytics this window will open in front of you then click on browse catalog then the catalog window will open in front of you so you can see in the catalog window or last report that is first bi report layout first bi report po information first bi report template so this is for the first bi report so today i will tell you how to schedule that bi report here is then a layout so under layout there is an a more so click on this arrow of more then here is one option schedule click on schedule when you click on schedule it will redirect you to this page so here what is this this is the report id okay so or we can say that it is a report path where our report is stored then if there is any type of a parameter in your report that parameter will comes under here that we will see in parameterized report then second option is output so which type of an output you require over here so here is html is default we will select pdf i want pdf output other things are if you want to change the language time zone and the calendar then you can change okay then save output because i want to save the output then scheduler what is scheduler scheduler means when you want to start that particular job you can select here tomorrow's date also so the report will schedule tomorrow automatically i am selecting run now because i want to run it now then you can having here one more option that is notifications if you want to get the notification suppose i had scheduled the report for tomorrow and i have to know that that report is scheduled or not for that there is a notification option so it will notify me that my report is scheduled if i gives my email id then i can also choose when i have to get that notification report completion report completed with warning report failed or report skipped any time you can get the notification or all times you can get the notification i don't want to have the notifications so i will not select that and the last one is diagnostic this is used for diagnostic purpose if you want to enable sql plan if you want to enable the data engine diagnostic so these are the dba related activity if you want any type of an dba related data then you can have to go with this diagnostic okay so we have to change only one thing the output format over here then you have to click on submit here is the submit button i'm clicking on the submit then i have to give the report job names so i'm giving the job name as first bi report i'm clicking on ok job first bi report successfully submitted so my job is submitted you won't get redirect from this page anywhere so you have to click on return and you click on the return you will come back to the catalog so how to see that the report is scheduled or anything else so click on more again and click on history when you click on history you will get this window over here then you have to click on search and here you can give the different types of criteria for searching also so that path i had mentioned you earlier so that is over here according on that path i am searching okay so what is the status of my report my report is run successfully how to see that report output here is the report job name click on the report job name then it will come here if you want to send that report you can send the report if you want to see the output just here is the output name so click on the output then you will see your report into the selected format i had selected pdf so i can see into the pdf then i can download that report also it will ask you for the path where to save that report so in this video we had seen that how to schedule the report using the scheduler and history in next video we are going to see the parameterized report how to pass the parameter to the report if you like this video don't forget to like share subscribe my channel technical talks with naresh to get more videos on oracle sql plsql oracle application oaf and other technologies thank you